Step 1 is Customer Setup. You will start by entering your employee password. This step allows managers to later see which employee looked up and handled which particular customers. As you see, the cursor in the customer search field is flashing. The system is asking you to identify the customer you wish to process. There are four different ways you can search for a customer. By last name, by phone number, by scanning or entering the customer's ticket number, or by scanning their name tag. Entering the customer's name, phone number, or ticket number will automatically pull them up from the system. If the customer is a new customer, entering their phone number will automatically take you to the page where you can enter the new customer information. Let's assume that this customer is a new customer. The customer gives you their telephone number, 678-240-9090. Once you enter their phone number into the customer search field, the system will let you know that this is a new customer and will prompt you with this message. Cannot find customer. Do you want to add customer? Click on Yes. You are taken to the Quick Add Customer screen. Here, in order to establish a new account, you are only required to enter the customer's last and first name, in this case, Mary Jones. Their phone number has transferred into this screen. At this point, you can indicate if the customer is to be billed or assigned a route. Also, you can set the price level for regular customers, wholesale consumers, hotels, etc. You can enter the customer's address. This would allow for automatic coupon mailings in the future. Also, you can indicate the customer's starch preference. Then click on Save. The system will automatically take you to step two.